all the sites are pretty good size they can handle a um, 40 foot motorhome or fifth wheel squirrel they all come with either a picnic table or a little table and chairs and if we come here and look inside the door there's two dogs hello dogs how are you stay there Zephyr hi Monty Hi everybody, this is Zephyr's Travels. I'm Randy. And I'm Diane. And this week we're at Buckhorn Lake RV Resort. And it's in the hill country of uh, Texas. It's probably, it's about 60 miles west of San Antonio. And it's a really nice park. Or resort. Resort. Yeah, it is a resort. It's, um, it's got a lot of amenities. It has a dog park. It has a nice little store, two oh, swimming pools, a laundry facility, two laundry facilities, just one at each pool. Oh, okay. And they have a uh, a nice recreation area. They show they have movie nights, so they must have like a movie theater in there. If it was locked, or I would have gone in and shown it to you. There's a nice little uh, lake that you might be able to see behind us. So we'll show you. foot deep dear it's just over your head <laughs> well no you'd be an inch sticking out a hot tub let's see how's the water pretty cold but this is March you can probably swim though probably probably this is a store and office that you come to when you check in Oh, they got wine. Mm -hmm. Oh, Behringer's. White Zephyrdale. Camping supplies. Snacks. Snacks and chips. All neatly arranged. Preserves. Oh, salsa. Movie rental. Ice cream. Cool. Friendly staff. This is the recreation hall, movie theater, party room, I guess. Movie night is Tuesdays. Have a social room, TV, sewing area, puzzles, books. They have an outside bar area for happy hours. Looks like cafe patio, so they probably sell some food or sandwiches on the weekends or something. Right off of uh, Interstate 10. So it's easy to get to places from here. So we found it very easy to get to San Antonio. It's also about 20 miles to Fredericksburg. And we took a ride up there and walked, toured through the town. And so where are we? 
Oi. Fredericksburg, Texas. Yeah. And uh, we've really enjoyed our time here. Yes, it's been very nice. The weather has been sunny and not real warm, but um, warm enough for this time of the year. Yeah, we're coming to you in mid-March, so you know it's still winter time, I guess, or just beginning of spring. And it, today kind of feels like a spring day. You yeah. know, it's you know probably about the upper 60s. There's a slight breeze, which is nice. Mm, not many clouds. No, no, hardly any clouds today. This is probably the best weather we've had since we've been we, in Texas. Since we've been in Texas. Yeah. Yep. Otherwise it has been cold and rainy, but today is a lovely day. Mm-hmm. So what do you like about the park? I don't know, I guess you always look for cleanliness of the park. Um, everybody keeps their site very clean. Um, the amenities are nice and plus the dog park for the dogs, they really enjoy it. They get to play with each other and not too much with other dogs, but they get to play with each other, which they really enjoy. So... And all the sites are fairly good size. You're not, you're not really on top of your neighbors that much. They're all got paved parking and a patio area. Yep. And you have, you know, we have a table and chairs, or you either have that or a picnic table. They have a, an adult only section um, over in the other area. But I don't see too many kids here anyways. So I do think it's more of a, uh, almost more of a little bit more of a retiree park, at least this time of year. I imagine in the summer, they get more families coming through here for summer break and whatnot. Yep. It is very much geared to large vehicles. So if you've got a 40 foot plus motor home or fifth wheel, they fit in its sights here with no problem. And what I've, something that I've never really seen in any other campgrounds is they have a pull-in site where if you have a motor home, you know, instead of backing it and you pull it in and then it gives you a nice view out your windshield of the river or, you know, something, you know, besides looking out on the street. Yep, the sights are all very nice and the dogs seem to enjoy it. Yeah, exactly. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to get this to get notified of future videos. Please hit the bell and leave us a comment if you wish to do so. Yep. And we will see you down the road. Bye. Bye.